Okay, hello everyone. I've noticed that I haven't really made a Miiverse video in a long time. And since I really don't have anything better to do right now, and I'm working on a current drawing, I was thinking why not make a new video on it, because the last video I made was like... Gosh knows how long ago, and um, I just thought it would be a great opportunity, especially since I finally got my voice back. Okay. Anyways. So as you can see right now, I've started working on it. And I start off doing a sketch, since I don't try to do perfect 100% copies, which I know a lot of people like to do, and you can use grids and Photoshop, but... I honestly just prefer to freehand everything, kind of, and do a sketch, and then I just look up different images, because you can see, go on Google Images to look up what I want, and even if you're not copying something, it's always a good idea to use a reference, because then you end up missing things, which I've learned, because I do ma draw maloettas, and I always, almost always miss the little headpiece. Or the microphone, and then people are like, what is that? Is that your OC? And I'm like, no, it's not my OC. Oh. <coughs> so, another thing I'd probably recommend is if you're drawing a female Nintendo character, you almost always want to turn your safe search on, even though that doesn't really help that much, because people like to draw inappropriate things and post them on here. So, if you're a little kid, just be careful, I guess, because you don't want... Uh, to see some of the stuff on here. Anyways, I was drawing Cat Peach, and before you're like, oh, you're drawing Cat Peach, ooh, sexy. Um, I've been drawing regular characters a lot, and I'm not doing a body picture. I wanted to do a close-up face. And what's cuter than a cat? Nyan, 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 am I right? So, I said I start off with a sketch drawing circles and guidelines, then I trace around that and make sure I have the right shape of it, making sure I have a reference on the side, and then, as you can see, I'm starting to color it in. Um, I don't grayscale it, even though I know that's what a lot of people use. Um, I just tap it in the same area repeatedly until it gets dark enough. Like this. And I just do that, kind of looking at a reference to see if it makes sense. Um, another thing I try to do is make sure that there's light coming from one side. In this picture, I'm trying to have it come in this direction. So, um, I make sure to do that in basically opposite directions. You want to make it extra dark. And... <laughs> Um, just have light coming through. And another thing is, about half of these pictures I like to use line art and half of them I don't. So I kind of erase around it and make it look kind of dotty. And I'm probably going to do the same thing around her eyes. So, let me get to that. Okay, so, um, <clears throat> I just finished up. A lot of the top hat part, and you can see, usually I do it half and half, so I do like the first half and the second half, but this time I thought I'd go just do bits by bits, so as you can see, that's about how the hat looks when it's done. Now with working on this, um, I'd say the biggest problem in it is, um that her nose is so freaking small and um for anyone who's used any system you know that it's really difficult to get those precision points in so making the nose is often really hard which is another reason why it's a good idea to have it on and i zoom in picture because if it's smaller that it's really difficult to do this style of artwork and no, I'm not done with her eyes. They look very creepy. Ooh, spooky! Spooky, spooky. And I need to clean up around her lips. They look very lopsided. But I'm not done yet, so... <clears throat> gotta keep working on this. I would not pause the video, but it would take 
me way longer time and I don't have one of those cool speed up things or unlimited memory. I'm just using my tablet. So bear in mind, I'm trying to play the video at the most crucial points or at least what I think is the most, bleh, most, most crucial. So again, I'm sorry, I guess. <laughs> Now, it's always kind of the challenge is for lips and stuff that's lineless because you never really know if you want to um, line art it or not. Um, this picture I've decided, I'm not done yet by the way, that I'm not going to um, erase the line art just because lips are very hard to detect on skin, especially when they're very similar color. And if you've noticed, probably looks better from far away, but the glare is getting to it. I tried to make one side of the face a lot darker than the other side, just because that's kind of how shading usually works. And I do need to do touch-ups, but I'll do that at the very end, because I want to get the basic idea down before I finish it up. So here's a continuation. Um, <clears throat> I've started to shade in the hand, I'm not done with it yet, and I tried cleaning up a few things that really bothered me, I still need to do the lips, and if you've noticed, I did kind of gradients on the tail. I just need to fix up a lot of things, and if you look at it, so that you know, when you look at things close up, they're not going to look super good, but that's because the 3D, or <laughs> 3DS. Um, the Wii U and the 3DS Miiverse app really doesn't have good precision. You can't zoom in at all, which would make this a heck of a lot easier if you could. So you're really limited on little pixels. As you can see, the pixels, a lot of those are just single pixels. And you just have to repeatedly stab <laughs> the Wii. Just be careful. Don't do anything too stupid. <laughs> Alright, so I've got a lot done. I'm going to add little whites into Peach's eyes. And I'm thinking about erasing some of the tail so it looks lighter and it kind of fades in. And maybe add some more paw prints, because paw prints are cute. <laughs> okay, so I've done a lot of the cleanup on the picture. It's almost done. As you can see, I've erased the line art for parts of it, where it should be light. By just kind of slashing like that repeatedly on the sides, making sure that it doesn't erase all the line art, it just hints that it's there, kind of. And I was thinking about doing kind of like scratchy paws, but I think I've decided that I'm just going to clean up the ones that I have and leave them like that, because it'll just be too chaotic, and it just looks weird. Or at least I think it looks weird. So I've just about finished up, and I wanted to show kind of the difference <laughs> in um, paw styles. I have this side, which is solid paws, and this side, which is scratchy paws. I have Peach here, I'm looking at the scratchy paws, but I think I like solid paws better. So, since I had saved this before, don't worry, it's all right here. Do -do 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 -do. And you've got a solid 3D peach. And so I'm going to post it right now. Peach. Petch. Petch. You can't see my stylus. Petch. No, yes. No. So let's see what is getting yes then. Not peach. Let's check out what is getting yes. All these beautiful pictures. Anime, anime everywhere. Ha! No. Of course, this is the YouTube community, which I can't get Yaz on to save my life. Not that that really matters. 
But I wanted to try going back to what I used to do because I am on a humor hiatus. Don't even know what that 100% means, but yeah. Because I'm just out of funny ideas, I guess. So I decided to kind of balance that out because I've known that a lot of people don't necessarily like my cartoons. And that's not necessarily a problem, but I do want to balance out my styles a little bit because... Well, cartoons are nice, they're not everything, though I don't know if I'll necessarily go back to anime, because, I don't know, pointy chins just, uh, I can't do it. I try, I try, I really do, but I just, I mean, I didn't do anything special like these, but I'm just not really I'm totally into copying things, just because if they come out warped, I feel like it's a little bit less special that way, but... It, that's just personally me. If you are, if, uh, if you feel different about that, then go ahead. And that is my video for today. Yay! If you have a Nintendo ID and would like to comment it, then maybe I'll check out your arts too, because people are special and I want to see how you draw. Okay, bye-bye.